developments tonight. UW-Green Bay is parting ways with its men's basketball coach after rumors swirled yesterday. The university made it official with an announcement this morning. Sports director Brandon Kinnard joins us now with those details. Brandon. And Nina, after a successful five-year run at Green Bay, which included a trip to the NCAA tournament in 2016, Link Darner is out in the announcement this morning. The university implied that it was a mutual decision, but regardless, the timing of this move is odd. It's mid-May. Typically, a decision like this would happen in March. And what makes it even more head-scratching is the fact that Darner had six more years left on his contract. Now, contract details are murky, but if they have to pay him out in full, his buyout would be worth more than $1 million, though it is possible that the two sides could reach an agreement to limit that buyout. UWGB has not commented on that, nor has it given a specific reasoning for Darner's dismissal. In the announcement today, new UW-Green Bay Chancellor Michael Alexander said, quote, we appreciate the leadership of Coach Darner and his focus on coaching and mentoring outstanding student athletes. He went on to say, we are a Division I university and remain committed to continuing the legacy of our outstanding Division I athletics program in the future. In that same release, Darner notably thanked former Chancellor Gary Miller and former Athletic Director Mary Ellen Gillespie, who hired him, but he did not mention Alexander or current Athletic Director Charles Guthrie. As for what's next, UWGB says it will now launch a national search for a new coach immediately. And also important to note here, the Phoenix have a massive recruiting class coming in next year. Eight new players set to join the program, all of whom were recruited and signed by Darner. I talked to a couple of those newcomers this afternoon who both said they were shocked and disappointed by this news. More on that coming up at 6. Nina?